So, how many hours did, would you typically work as a professor, Tony? Oh my goodness. <laughs> well, 23? No, not 23. 22. Well, in, in the classroom, in the classroom, I have, uh, I'm in the classroom 18 hours a week. Yeah. Um, when I include prep time for that, it's easily over 40 or 50 hours a week mm -hmm. in terms of marking, in terms of preparing for classes, uh, and then meeting students. Yeah. So there's a lot of time. It's, it's, it's really more than full time. So how, how, how many years did you say you basically set your down your, can your personal camera and practice for? Well, I had, uh, I had started taking pictures when I was in university back in the 70s, and then I, I seriously pursued photography for about 10 years. Mm -hmm. and, uh, commercial I had, or fine not art? Commercial, no, just fine art. Mm -hmm. I, I, I was doing it on the side. I worked uh, in a photo store, then I worked at an audiovisual production company. So I was always working with photographs, but, and, and I just left photography and doing my own work on the side. I never wanted to earn my living shooting. Right. I just never, I never wanted to do that. Um, and that was a deliberate choice I made when I was quite young. Um, so I exhibited and uh, I have work uh, collected by the Alberta Art Foundation. I've got, I had, I had shows, group and solo shows uh, in Edmonton. I was living in Alberta at the time. And then I got onto the computer. Mm -hmm. And once I started working on the computer, again around the mid 80s, then I, uh, I kind of left the camera behind for almost 20 years. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and, and really uh, learned my craft as far as computers concerned. I did video games, I worked on uh, audiovisual projects, did video, uh, and really just left the camera behind. So upon meeting Lucy, did she sort of re-stimulate your passion for your own practice? Well, that's certainly been evolving. I think it started actually just before Lucy and I met. Mm -hmm. I, had, uh, I, I had been fortunate enough to be hired full-time as a professor at Georgian. And uh, as a result of that, I was able to relax a bit and start getting back into photography because I teach photography at mm -hmm. Georgian then there was the impetus there to start getting back into it. But being with Lucy has really been uh, a, a, real, a real boost for me because being with another creative person has really helped me to uh, you know, kind of focus on that aspect of my life more and more. Mm -hmm. and so from that perspective, the influence is really positive. 